episodes a day mark the start of a worldwide zombie apocalypse, in which millions of the dead rose from the grave to devastate civilization. Since then, areas across the globe have been stabilized and made secure. But those areas outside are still prone to zombie attacks with no signs of change. More on that at 10. In the meantime, John has a zombie forecast. What can we expect tonight? Hello, my name is Carlos, and this was a zombie. The greatest menace to man outside of the large city environments. Out here in the outskirts, only skilled individuals, known simply as zombie hunters, are capable of eliminating this undead threat. This is Brad Summers and Jane Hart, professional zombie hunters. They've now been doing this for three years and show no signs of stopping. All right, well, uh... I mean, Jane here, we've been hunting zombies for more years now. Yeah. yeah it's been ages. Mm. But you know, there's a fair few of the uh, things out there that keep us occupied. Mm. I mean, we could have easily just stayed in the house this whole time. We've got enough supplies to last. Canned food, fresh water, yeah. weapons. But you just never know when one of the undead are going to break into your house and tear you apart. That's right. It's nice to get out every now and then, isn't it? I mean, get some fresh air. Fresh air. Mm. Right, guys, as you know, life is very hard in the outskirts. I mean, especially for the likes of Brad and Jane. I mean, I think I can really relate to their situation. I mean, it was really tough trying to get through in the X Factor, and it was something like war makes you want it more, leaves it. Uh, Brad and Jane. Brad and Jane. Now, out here in the outskirts, I've seen a, a lot of people lose their loved ones to the zombies. Have you guys, you know, ever lost anyone close to yourselves? Oh, um, well, not too many. Well, there was one we lost a little while ago, wasn't there, Brad? Yeah. Mm. yeah. It's my boyfriend. Do you mean your ex? Boyfriend? Uh-huh. Yeah. We were trying to get away from the undead one day and one of them just lunged out at him and then took a bite out of his ankle and wow, well, that was that. Guys, cut. Sorry, one second. One second, guys. Now, the most obvious fact about zombie hunters is that they hunt zombies. I mean, if they didn't hunt zombies, they'd have to hunt something else. So, Brad Summers is going to show us just how he does it. And come along, let's follow me. Brad. All right, yeah. Well, you follow me and uh, we'll get started. seen this yet and it went for a little while so this is what we're gonna do. And that's how you deal with the undead. Unless of course it's a fast mover then well you use more ammo or maybe a shotgun. Sorry, sorry. Is that all you do? Pretty much, yeah. Why, is uh, there a problem? Well, um... 
It's no problem. No, right. no, no, no problem. That's I love great. it. No problem. No. As Brad and Jane have proven, hunting the undead seems to be rather easy. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. However, what happens when these two aren't equipped with their guns? Hey Brad, how's it going? Alright. What you got back then? I'm just sorting out the weapons for tomorrow. Guns. Yeah, no problem with that? More guns. I mean, look. No problem with that whatsoever. I love guns. Do you know what I mean? It's just I don't think it's particularly engaging for our viewers. And um, you know, I look, I'm kinda nodding, you know, kinda nodding away back here. I let's mix it up a little. Let's baseball bats, stabbing weapons. Or maybe weapons. Seriously. <sighs> No, no, no guns whatsoever. Well, maybe the you know maybe the one pistol for limited ammo. But you know, um, look, what's wrong with that? Well, we might fucking die for starters. You see, they're not as effective no, as guns. No, 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 no. no. You ain't gonna die. You're professional zombie hunters. You ain't gonna die. Listen, just make it a bit more exciting for the viewers. Think of the ratings. You know. <gasps> Think of the ratings. All right. Yeah. yeah? You got that? All right, sure, no problem. I'll uh, close. Yeah, I'll sort some. Closer, closer. Safety's boring. Yeah. Okay. Now, Brad's gonna show us just how he goes about hunting the undead without guns. So, Brad. Right. Well, it's a pretty simple task, really. Okay. Basically, you. Uh, well, you've got to engage the undead foe and uh, nice. strike him in the head. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, Carlos. And here, will you, mate? Dangerous, isn't it? This is what zombie hunters have to deal with each and every day. <laughs> wow. What the fuck's that? Get it! Get it! Oh! Get it out. I don't think I'm We're in the clear. We're in the clear. Oh, shit, man. Thank God for that. Now that was tense. <laughs> I mean, imagine how bad it would have been if we weren't actually. Got any? No way. Look, your damn reins ain't worth the risk of that. You'll probably kill us. You lot included. Oh, I lighten up. Untwist your knickers. <sighs> no, we're safe. <laughs> what? Stay here, TV boy. Move. Hey. We need the footage. Go, really? Follow her. Quick, quick, quick. Fuck this show, man. Fuck this show. Are you scared? Yes! Why the fuck aren't you? Fucking hell, man. Chill out. We're, we're safe in here. We're good. We're nice. So just relax. Alright, man. Come on. Fuck! Listen, we said no guns. We promised. It, it, it would make it a, a ton more exciting. Listen, I mean, listen! I'm all worried about saving our lives and your career, thanks. Listen, listen. Never mind my career. This, 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 you know, it would help to show you're struggling against them. You know? <laughs> Tons of footage, tons of footage. Yeah, it's going amazing. Yeah, yeah, it's going amazing. It's going to... Well, well yeah, of course. I, I almost died a few times. Fantastic job. Amazing. Yeah, whatever. Whoa! It's going great. He's a complete dick. No, you're right, he is. No. We could have died out there. He was the one who brought them to us. All he cares about is his damn ratings and how he looks on camera. I'm all for saving people as much as possible, yeah, but this guy, yeah, he's got to go. Go? Yeah, you know, as in gone, disappeared, ended. Look, look. Oi! 
Oh god. Get up here. Um, uh, How much that did you wear? Uh, um, uh. Are you gonna help us? Uh, yeah, uh, however I can. I want him gone as well. Well. Maybe not gone, maybe. Maybe put in a position where he could be. Oh, so you've got a plan? Yeah. Put that thing away. We don't want to Right. Now, tonight, we've got a real treat for you viewers. Um, Brad has found us a couple of fast movers and he's going to show us just how he takes the agile bastards out. So, Brad? Well, right. well. It's easier to deal with these than you think. Okay. Aim right. Alright. And get him in the legs. In the legs. You slam down. Slam down. Oh no! Huh? <laughs> I seem to have missed! <laughs> well, we better run. Oh, shit. Quit fucking me! Uh, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> oh, fuck. So, how are we doing losing them? Well, it's easy. We just dropped some bait to distract them. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Bait? What, what kind of bait was that? Oh, fuck! Oh. That kind of oh. bait. Oh! Run! Fuck! Oh. Oh. Come on! Oh. 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 Fuck, you trying to leave me? Oh. Fuck it, I ain't leaving Carlos. Oh. 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 Oh.